Hello everybody, my name is Andrew and welcome back to Hatoful Boyfriend, the game where we date pigeons. Let's jump right in. Today is the hike. We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to... Ryochu, Sakuya, San... Mm, I guess we can talk to Sakuya. Unacceptable! In a temper as usual, why? Why do I have to come to a place like this and on foot? It's a hike, Sakuya. You have to walk. For what purpose? As exercise foolishness, exercise it for peasants. No, for fun. You were supposed to enjoy the change of scenery. Look over there. Look over here. Don't we have a nice view? Sakuya looks like he still has something to say, but he reluctantly comes over to me. I think maybe he's acting angrier than he really is. Sheesh, what a kid. Pretty douchey, that dude. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Attend math, gym, or music. Let's go to gym class. Try to get in shape. It's too hot. I feel like I'm gonna have a stroke. Cool! It's rehydration time! Uncle Sam wants to go swimming! Andrew leveled up. Vitality increased by five. Very nice. Very nice. Vitality is very important. Uh, imagine you're all well aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? If it were in the fall, I would conflict with the cultural festival, so it's always been in May. What are you gonna do, Ryota? I haven't decided, but probably three-legged race. Some birdie has to. Some birdie. Every birdie. No birdie. Cool! Of course, will handle the marathon, and indeed he will. You do have a lot of stamina, Okusan. What about you, Sakuya? You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? It's a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? How about being a cheerleader? Uh, the general, in other words, very well. Leave it to me. Um, I don't think that's... Also, the first aid team is always short-handed, so I'm sure they could use help if anybody still can't decide. That's all for today. Ryota's doing three-legged race. Okosan's running the marathon, and Sakuya's a cheerleader. Yuya might be running the first aid tent. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. Decisions, decisions. Today's a sports festival. I never did make up my mind. What should I do? Go to the three-legged race, marathon, cheerleaders, first aid tent, or library. Let's go to cheerleaders and, and try to try to make friends with, with this dude. There's something of a crowd around our cheerleaders. I see Sakuya and a brass band that's overdoing it. I think I saw something similar during the changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace. You're here! You're not cutting any corners, I see. Naturally not! Only the best from a uh, libel. Sir, preparations are complete, sir. Your order, sir. Very well, begin. And so the band began to play. Where did you get these people? They all look like professionals. Shouldn't cheerleaders be students? You, join in. I'm um, okay. I seem to be in charge of the symbols. One wrong slip, and I'll be laughing stock at the playground. Yikes. Sakuya is conducting his awful flashy. Is this the Labelle style? The first barrier for all students who make it this far, the midterm exam. We're getting them back today. Ah, I don't think I did too well. Dog! Yes? That was a great second name. I knew it as soon as I said it. Hmm, I don't think you did too badly. Yes? Not too... Um, nope, sorry, you did badly. Oh, come on. No! Try harder next time, okay? I disappointed Mr. Nanaki. I'll have to study more from now on. Aw, oh, man. With the festival and midterm over, there's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. Doves smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. Huh. There's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya. Yuya, what's going on? Salutations, Andrew. Brian won seven Pulitzer. He gestures at an ooze clipping of the staff room pinboard. It says Brian the first intelligent pigeon crowned again. Brian? 
Don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... He's the world's most famous blogger. He began with birds barely were intelligent. Wow, look at all those photorealistic pigeon pictures. So hot. He's a very skilled and insightful writer. He was the one who suggested that he drove the Olympics be called Pigeon Olympics. The Double Olympics. He's extremely influential. The name was dropped. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, Monami? Try googling Brian Pigeon. Okay. Okay! Uh oh. Lunch is nearly over. Adieu, Andrew. Well, that rhymed. I guess it wasn't meant to. Uh, I'd better hurry back to class. Hello, every bear. Huh? There's a pile of overturned desks in the middle of the floor. Ryota is overturned next to them. Rock doves, underwings, and bellies are light. So they look pretty different upside down. I mean, wait, uh, Okasan and Sakuya are... I looked up to see the two of them at each other's throats in the corner. I think we might have a diplomatic incident in our hands. What happened, Ryota? Sakuya was making fun of Okosan. He called him a stupid mongrel who only thinks about imaginary pudding and said he was ashamed to be in the same class. That's terrible. I mean, Okosan is a nutcase and I don't know what he's tr saying half the time, but he really does like pudding. Either way, Okosan kind of went for the jugular and you tried to put him apart and Okosan used wing attack on you. Yup. Your only hope, Andrew. <laughs> Oko-san will not allow pudding or himself to be ridiculed. You will apologize. You tell me to back my word, I shall not. A mongrel like you hasn't the right to speak to me. Koo! Oko-san is not a mongrel. The battle still raged and it looked like Ryuta's sacrifice was in vain. I should... Side with Sakuya, side with Okusan, or scold them both. Scold them both. This is this is not acceptable for any of them. Okusan, calm down. Cool. Do you think Okusan can calm down after such insults? Well, mongrel dog is on my side. You too, Sakuya. You have acted immaturely. What? No more fighting, you two. Th take this for Ryuta! I grabbed them both and hurled them to the window into the courtyard. Stay out there and think about what you've done. Jeez. My god, conflict averted. Put them both in their place. Mm. Today is a good day. I feel like I'm shiny. I wonder what I should do during break. Go to the... Um... I'll go to the infirmary, to that weird doctor. Oh, there he is. You again, are you ill? Oh, not exactly. Then why are you here? I came here to... Hear your voice. I wanted to hear your voice. My voice? Yes, you sound like Snufkin. And? Um, don't tell me you came here just for that. Would it be bad if I did? You're even stranger than I thought. I'm fascinated how I'd love to experiment on you. Sadly, I'm busy at present. Please go somewhere else. Okay. I got kicked out. I guess being told I'm interesting is a step in the right direction. Or is it? That guy is super weird. Today's elective day, what should I do? Uh, I'm music class again, I guess. We all have to stand up and sing solos today. I'm nervous. Cuckoo, cuckoo, cuckoo. His voice is beautiful. <laughs> what? Andrew leveled up, charisma increased by five. Oh yeah. Okay, and now we're back home in our cave where we live in. Today is Tanabata. There's probably a bamboo there in the plaza this year, too. I think I'm gonna make a wish. Wow, there's lots here already. Anybody I know? My mother stay healthy this year, and may my stomach get better, Ryuta. What should I wish for? I wish to become a famous artist. I wish to become a famous artist whose work is known the world over. Oh, hello. Is that you, Dao? Mr. Naraki! You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know. <laughs> I'm a girl, that's right. I was about to head home. Um... Well, okay. Yes, please. All right. Mr. Naraki demonstrated some extreme sleeping on the way home, but we arrived eventually. 
Your home is very rustic, dog. I like it this way. It's wonderful to have a place to come back to, isn't it? Wonderful indeed. He looks a little sad. Um, sir, see you tomorrow. Don't forget your homework. And so he left, a somewhat hollow-sounding farewell echoing behind him. Or was it just my imagination? So yeah, I mean, that guy is a true gentleman. He walked me home. Late hours for, for a girl. So yeah, that'll be it for today. We made some progress, we made some new friends, and we got a little closer to a couple of pigeons, if you know what I mean. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please leave a like if you did, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.